I'm Sergeant First Class Patricia Morgan from the United States Army Band, Pershing's Own, and today I'll be discussing finger transitions between the notes E, D, and C in the bass clef staff. Let's review the fingering for each note. All of these notes require that you keep the whisper key down. It's the left hand thumb key. Consider it a home for your thumb. To play E, keep the whisper key down and add the first finger to the uppermost hole at the front of the instrument. To play D, keep the whisper key down and first finger as well and add the middle finger. To play C, keep the whisper key down, first and second fingers down as well and add the ring finger. <laughs> In order to transition from note to note, make sure you keep the whisper key down and the fingers relaxed yet secure. Leave the previous note's fingers down if you are descending. To move quickly between these notes, keep the fingers close to your instrument, not pointed out away from the instrument. Practice your transitions from note to note slowly and make sure your fingers stay secure while covering the holes. To play things that are quick, we first need to practice slowly so that the movement is smooth and clean. The goal is to lift the finger off of the hole entirely in one movement so that the subsequent sound uh, is the true pitch that you want. And that's it. Those are your first three notes, E, D, and C.